it's caught in the crossfire. Happy Monday, my lovies. This should be uh, fun. Fun for the most part. <laughs> Enjoy. Hey, Gucci Trolls. What's up? Hey, Beluga. Uh, so, I guess I could take this video opportunity uh, that I decided to come on live now. To do a video that I have to do anyway. Uh, so apparently I was told, and I don't remember this, I honestly don't. Hey, good time at Mass. How are you? I'm doing all right. I'm glad your Mass was good. I'm extremely hungry. We have, we've we been out of EBT since like the 11th. So for anyone who's never been on EBT, um, the way that it goes is they refill it every month based on the eight uh, digit in your social security number. I think it's one of the last four digits. Um, so one through nine, correct? So they got their food stamps on the first through the ninth and here he is on the 11th claiming that EBT is already out and they need more money for food money that was supposed to last for EBT that was supposed to last for 30 days lasted them nine correct me if I'm wrong but that's what I'm hearing <laughs> and uh, I'm pretty sure I'm not wrong ridiculous and we've been surviving on little things here and here and there and I really if somebody could help me out with some uh, food money I I'd really appreciate it like 20 or 30 bucks if possible that would be real see that's the problem here Jason someone did help you out it's called the government they gave you EBT and you two idiots ran through it in nine days you already got help there was your help homie it's gone now how's that uh, name brand dr. pepper working out for you now really nice high bling and things been making beef stew all day in the crock pot it smells good yeah that's that's awesome stuff Gucci trolls I, I love that crock pots are awesome apparently if you make according to foodie beauty if you make a beef stew and you add tomato paste yeah. and peanut butter it turns into this African dish called mafi it oh, sounds yeah. really good yeah I've heard of that mafi yeah I've heard of that definitely Shani, I don't know if you think you and Chantal are friends, but I'm here to tell you that I don't think you are. <laughs> I don't think she knows too much about you or really wants too much to do with you, but you'll keep name dropping her as if you two are buddies. Give it up. So, uh, <clears throat> if you can help me with food money, I'm going to pin this, all right? Um... Uh, all these things I'm gonna pat I'm, gonna, I'm sorry I just you know I hate this guys meatball you don't hate it enough to get some pride and not do it you could you wouldn't catch me dead doing this not you wouldn't catch me dead doing this not a, a ch not a snowball's chance in hell would you catch me online e-bagging day in and day out and day in and day out like this. It would absolutely never, ever, ever, ever happen. There are a million other ways to get food. You do not need people's cash. You don't need that. You're just going to take it because you're greedy. And I'm sure there's a Delta 8 uh, trip in the, in, in the future. And grape jelly chili sauce in a crock pot. That sounds awesome, man. Yeah. Frozen bowls. Yeah. Oh. God, my head is. <sighs> wow. Sorry. I'm trying to get all these out. That's why Sophia Loren is the queen. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, my dad loved her. You'll notice throughout this uh, video that the more Rev talks about how much pain he's in, the more Shani overshadows him with what she's going through and how much pain she's in and all of her problems because it can never not be about her. She's 
she refused to starve herself. Yeah, exactly. Do that. Do we have a dollar land near us? Yeah, 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 yeah. We have a dollar tree that's like in Scranton, which is pretty far away from us, and it's just a nightmare. Uh, what the hell is that one? I don't even know if I can remember that one. Yeah, okay. It's my name. Oh, my head uh, is splitting in half. It hurts so bad. I'm sorry, baby. It's so bad. So there's all of our uh financials. Can I just point out Rip Rosaline Carter? Yeah. She was a wonderful person and a mental health advocate. Yeah, God bless her. She passed away and Jimmy's Jimmy, probably not gonna be very far behind her. We'll go to heaven together. Yep. Um I sent you guys many twice and nobody ever said thank you. I I don't know, dude. If if you if you send something, I'm t if there's a way for me to get you a message, you'll get a thank you. I can tell you that. So I don't know. How about right now? I'm so sorry that I missed that. Thank you so so much for giving us money. We are beyond grateful. What can I do to thank you? Like right now. Here you go. Here's your opportunity. If I can get you a message, what the hell does that mean? You're you're online. Pizza? Would you feel like a pizza? Fine pizza. Yeah, if you wanted, that would be great if you could send a pizza. Soda would be nice too. Oh, how audacious is that? Don't just send us a free pizza because, you know, we are losers who can't pay for it ourselves. But don't forget the soda too for Shani because that 500 pound beast needs soda. Because the water here sucks. Listen. The working thing, look, I'm not talking about my personal life anymore on the internet. I'm waiting to get paid on Wednesday. Well, if you're employed, congratulations. And why are we getting so testy about it? Why are we getting so mad if you have a job and there's nothing to hide? Sounds pretty sketch to me. I'm not talking about my personal life anymore. I'm waiting to get paid on Wednesday. That's why I'm coming on here to try to get some food money. Spicy pizza? No, we wouldn't. We'd like just a normal pizza. Just regular pizza would be great if you could do that. That would be awesome. We can't do spicy stuff. We have ulcers. No. Yeah. We have ulcers. Another undiagnosed ailment of Shani's. When did you get diagnosed with an ulcer? It, actually, when did that actually happen? Oh, that's right. It never did. It never did for either of you. Just another lie. Don't send us a spicy pizza because we have ulcers. People with ulcers have a hard time eating pizza in general at all because of the sauce. So you'll take that, but you won't take a spicy one because you're ulcers. <laughs> Give me a break. So does soda. Soda gives, gives you the same problems, you dope. Yeah, we can't do spicy. We both. Well, beggars can't be choosy, and if someone sent you a spicy pizza and you were so starving, you would eat it. I, I don't know. I don't know where you get off saying otherwise. I'm paying you all back. What the hell are you talking about? I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. You don't have to listen. To There's me. a video that I I have to make anyway, so I'm, that's what I'm going to do here. You don't have to do the video because you didn't do anything that they wanted you. I mean, I know that. I was told that I called Gary the N-word in Colorado towards the end of it. <laughs> I do not- such bullshit. We were talking friendly with him and everything then. Right, exactly. Oh no, it happened. I saw it with my own two eyes. It 100% happened. Exactly. I don't remember this. This is what I was told did happen. There's apparently a, a channel called Fat Courtney Love or something that has that on it. Bullshit. of me doing it so i want to apologize publicly to gary for calling him the n-word i do not remember it i don't but if it happened um if it's on video obviously it did happen so i apologize for it i believe the word is not a word that should be used anymore it's it has too much stuff behind it and i condemn it and i and i'm sorry for my own actions and that's all there is to it didn't david anthony call you the N -word? 
That's not all there is to it. Nice apology and all, but that's not all there is to it. We're, I don't know, he probably did. Yeah, actually, the donos, it's like, it is donations. It is. They're just doing that to cause problems. But honestly, the main reason I did come on here right now is because I am really hungry. And, uh, and I could use I'm, some food. Yeah, you too. Well, I'm more thirsty than anything. Okay. So I'll eat the pizza, but just make sure you send me that sodi, okay? Don't forget. Okay, Kelly saw it, so there you go. It happened. I don't support that crap. I don't. And At that time, we were wrapped up in that Trumpism MAGA shit, so... Yeah. I'm sorry. What the hell does being a Trump supporter have to do with calling someone you called a friend the N-word? Where's the correlation in that? Uh, I, I fail to see it. I fail to see it. Sorry, too, if I ever said that on camera. Mm -hmm. Around that time. Oh, my God. Pizza and Taco Bell are on the way. They said 30 minutes. That's awesome. Okay. Don't lie about that, though, because that'd be really rough. Hi, Vixen. Uh, all of our... Uh, the Cash App, PayPal, and Venmo are pinned. If you want to send some money. And thank you so much. Any one of them will work. Yes, we were wrapped up. It, okay. Snoop Dogg is eating edibles. Okay, so he didn't quit. He quit well, smoking. Well, he quit smoking, but he eating edibles. So yeah, he he's still partaking in THC. Yes. Just the smoking part. He, I figure he probably has like lung cancer uh, or emphysema or something like that. I don't know. Something lung related. Probably, yeah. Yeah, this stand doesn't work to do that. Unfortunately. I'll, I'll help Jerry. There we go. That's good. You. That's good. It's fine. Just so extra. And we get a gap. Protection. It's very low lighting in here, but there's a gap in here. No, 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 no. Don't send anything to Rev Dude PayPal. No. I gave you the I gave you the information. Don't use that one. Send it to Hey there, you little gremlin. How about you drop your attitude, okay? Drop that attitude right now. Uh. <sighs> oh, I'm so sick to my stomach right now. Would you stop talking about you're gone. You're gone. Yeah, we haven't been alive in a, quite a while, Michelle Ann. Thank you for your prayers. We appreciate that. I do need prayers. Um, my health is getting really bad. Oh, here the fuck we go, loveys. Her health is getting worse. It's actually getting worse while she sits there and chats away about Snoop Dogg and this and that. Can't you just hear the pain in her voice? Can't you just see what suffering suffering this woman is going through do any of you have a heart because if you did you would you would you would feel so bad for her and you would send her all the money that you could and just just you know just poor pity pity victim fucking shanny um especially uh my cognitive abilities yeah it's it's i gotta go your cognitive abilities are being affected now? No, you're just extremely unintelligent and extremely ignorant. There is no cognitive problems with you. You are absolutely fine. You're just very, very fucking stupid. So spare us the explanation of what's going on with your cognitive abilities and how they're being affected. Affected by what? You still don't have anything really wrong with you that anyone can prove. Not even you. Can't wait to hear this one. Go to the doctor and get tested for a bunch of stuff again. That's a lie. She does not have any appointments to get any tests done for anything. That's a lie. <laughs> Yeah. Because my I'm like cognitively failing. And Sugar Plum, you've been failing cognitively since you came into this world, okay? You have failed cognitively since the moment your mother 
gave birth to you. Yo stunad. My memory is failing really bad lately. I can't even really read these messages. It's giving me such a worse headache. I'm sorry, my love. It's very hard for me to look at the, this. I would, but my phone is updating its system. Okay. Yeah, I know. Get rid of the trolls. That's what I want. And of course, when I come on here, when I don't feel good, that's what I'm going to get, too. So. Whether you feel good or not, you're going to get trolls because people can't stand you two because of this very behavior. They're messed up. They need therapy. I'm so sick of it. Huh. Depression research study gets six hundred dollars oh, a day. God. Well, since I have chronic depression, I, I, I'll, hell, I'll do that. I'll, I'll go into some depression research study. But first of all, you have no diagnosis. Secondly, it's clinically depressed. Chronically means that there's no cure for it and you have it for the rest of your life, which is not how depression works, which you'd think Miss Psychology over here would know, but I guess not. No, dear, nobody's taking you in for any clinical studies and paying you for it. A, because you don't have depression, period. Because if you did, you would know it. It's hell. You haven't even touched clinical depression. You have no idea how fucking awful it really is. Because if you did, you'd be treated for it. Because being not treated for it is living hell. See, every time I click on trying to get into these research studies, it's always like it's not available in your area, so. Yeah, that's that's usually the case, pretty much. <clears throat> uh, but, but if it's for real, thank you so much for the, the pizza and Taco Bell. That's awesome. I appreciate that a lot. I think we all appreciate it. <laughs> Shani, hold your breath until the pizza and the Taco Bell arrive, okay? Do us all a favor. Up in the sizzle. Yeah. I have to go pee pee soon. I have to go pee pee soon. Rev, you better get your toilet paper. Uh -huh. No, that's fine. Pizza and Taco Bell's fine, Beluga. Thank you. Yeah, the friends and family thing. That is I would be very skeptical if someone whose name was Beluga was lying and saying that they were sending me food. <laughs> is important, Gucci Trolls. Thank you for that. I don't have much family. Well, we're not, Vixen, we're not, we won't have money for food for tomorrow. So if you can send like, like 20 or 30 is usually what I say to people. And I know that's not a small amount either, but it's, everything is so expensive. It's, it's hard to not, it, it's in always in the 20 or $30 range to get something that's substantial. What a shock, 20 or $30, the same amount we always ask for. You can get a lot of food for a lot less than that if you did it smartly and you did it with a brain, but you don't do that. It might not be salmon and Dr. Pepper, but you can get other foods for a lot less than that, trust. So that would be amazing if you could help us out with that. And thank you. People are real tired of helping you guys out. People are really over it because it never, ever, ever, ever stops. Uh. But yeah, that that it is crazy, isn't it? They can even use they can even use PayPal That's to scam you. you, huh? That's you. She wants a good guy with an edge, the kind that walks up behind her, kisses her on the neck, lifts her skirt, and slides her panties to the side. Damn right! Wow, that was last night. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it was. Ew! Ew! And this is a woman who's in so much agonizing pain. But that was us last night. <laughs> You two are disgusting and nobody wants to vision that. No one wants to put that in their brains. Please do not talk about your disgusting sex life ever, ever again. None of us need the visual. We saw it on OnlyFans. We don't need to see it in our minds at all. Please, 
please. And what a joke, Shani. I thought your, your health was getting so much worse. I thought your cognitive abilities were failing. And you just, your health was failing. But last night, ooh, gross. Blech. That's pretty hot, though. <laughs> that is my moves, too. Come up behind you when you're, like, in the kitchen or something and slip my hands right underneath you and pull it to the side. That's accurate. <laughs> oh, God. Rem's got all the moves, ladies. How do you even fit your arms around Shani to do such a thing? Shut up. <laughs> my baby. And thank you, guys. Would you accept money for a video call sometimes, or does it depend on what? Nah, we don't do that type of stuff. I, I mean, I could. Shani, that's dumb. You that's, never know what's going to happen. That's really huh? dumb. That's dumb. It's not worth it. I, I watch you all the time, mostly the joke pages, until I found your real page and realized you're not who they make you guys. I'll send 20. Thank you, Vixen. Thank you, Vixen. God bless. Thank Jesus you. Bless. I, oh. Thank you. Yes. Seriously, we need every, every cent. Every bit, every. Thank you so much. Thank you, like hugely. Thank you. Do you know how horrible the tap water is here? It's so bad. There's something wrong with the tap water here. I don't know, dude. I don't know at all. But it's yeah. And no, I don't have diabetes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they don't even think it's a good idea to do video. If, chats, right? if I had Fuji water or or uh, the, the the mountain spring water. I, I feel like I'm not thirsty. Right. The tap water here, though, I don't know what they put in the water, but it's dehydrating as hell for some reason. Yeah, it is. Let me check. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. You can, you can send to the Cash App, yeah. Thank you. I know you help all the time when you can, Michelle Ann, and we appreciate you so much. Thank you. Old pipes? Yeah, maybe. God bless you, Vixen. You're awesome. Thank, thank you for doing what you're going to do. I appreciate that. Oh, my God. Congratulations. You've managed to scam a couple more kind-hearted people who believed your bullshit. Congratulations. Okay. But, yeah, the world gets crazier every day. I know that much. Every day. I'm in PA, man. Oh, that was you, Michelle Ann? That was you? Thank you, Michelle. Yeah, I'll be I'm I'm I'll be watching and waiting for the tacos and pizza. Thanksgiving? Uh no, that was Michelle Ann that gave ten bucks. Are you gonna be going speaking of Thanksgiving, are you working? Or never mind. Uh do you have any plans, dear, for Thanksgiving? I know I don't have any plans. I don't know. My plans are your plans. <laughs> I just love to discuss mental. Oh, Shani almost dimed you out there real quick, didn't she? She doesn't know what you're doing on Thanksgiving. I find that hard to believe. Hey, maybe you could guilt or, you know, get people to send you a whole Thanksgiving dinner. Wouldn't that be great? Health with all types of people around the world. I also enjoy others' view on religion, but I obviously understand your hesitation with your history of issues. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, like, yeah, others lying, etc. Yeah, I'm done with it. I, 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 with this thing, this, I, I appreciate all the nice people. I really do. And people that they give when they can is so sweet. The world is so bad right now. Now, our churches don't do that type of stuff, Gucci Trolls. They don't. Does anyone know of any church in this country that does not help out during the holidays for families that are poor? But the churches around them don't do it. But every other one in the country does? Bullshit. You don't want that. You want people's money. You want people's money and for people to s send food to your house. They really don't. The only church I need is the Bible. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> Not in this time and age. <laughs> Can't trust anyone anymore in this world. No. They'll stab you in the back 
and 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 twist Ugh. everything you say. This world is hard to live in nowadays. Yeah. Oh yeah, L the world is so hard to live in when you have nothing to do, nothing to wake up for tomorrow, nowhere to go, and just wait for people to drop food in your mouth. That's basically how hard life is for you two, schmucks. Spare us all on how hard it is to live in this world when you guys don't do anything at all. I, like, I'm just at the point in my life where I'm waiting for Jesus Christ. Because I ain't getting any better physically. No. Um, oh, you could get better physically. You, you don't have cancer. You're not terminally ill with anything. You choose not to get better because you like being the victim in fake pain or whatever it is. You, you're waiting for Jesus. Honey, I hope you live to your 95 years old. And I hope that you realize that where you're going is not heaven. Okay? It's not. Not even close. It's very, very toasty where you're headed. Because you are a vile, vile woman. I'm not, I, I just, like, I just, don't, I just don't. When you're in pain all the time, and your mind is slipping away into something, some kind of void. Yeah, thanks Michelle Ann it, a lot. It makes life. I've already looked Gucci Gucci trolls, don't worry about it. It's <laughs> just not something that's around here. What's not around here? Churches that give baskets of food. Oh no, no! Everything's closed down, and they just all the church wants to do is promote Donald Trump. They just don't do it. I don't. I don't get churches anymore. It's like they've politicized pre rolls. Oh my god, that would be amazing. <laughs> pre rolls. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, I bet it would. I bet it would. Michelle Ann's in pain all the time, too. You feel that, too? Yeah, it just takes the fucking joy out of life. Like... Yeah. There's only a few pleasures where I'm not in pain. And I can't even state one, because it's like, no, you're still in pain. Mm -hmm. But so <laughs> Rev does not even care. Rev's heard this so many times, he could not care any less. We've all heard it. Uh, we've heard it a hundred times. We get it. You're in pain. I want enjoy. <laughs> oh, you mean for Thanksgiving, Gucci Trolls? Yeah, I, I'm. Uh, they might have food banks that are out there that that give for Thanksgiving. It's possible. And they I'm, did that like two weeks ago. At um, what is this? What is the arena here? Huh? They did that in the arena. A, a Thanksgiving food giveaway at an arena in downtown Scranton. An arena or something like that. I have. Yeah. I don't know. Like, then why didn't you two get your happy asses down there when they were doing that? That would have been helpful, right? I don't know. That's how, that's that's what I've seen, anyway. Now, yeah, bless you. All you guys say is share your pain meds. Scoliosis <laughs> and herniated disc for me, 10 years. Oh, I'm so sorry. My God. Yeah, that's horrible. Yeah, I got. I'm diagnosed right now with fibromyalgia and um, severe arthritis. Uh, you weren't diagnosed with those things. Those doctors just uh, y uh, yesed you to death, gave you some gabapentin, and told you to get on your way. That's that's all. You weren't diagnosed with anything. Just like you weren't diagnosed with breast cancer. You fucking liar. My knees messed up, man. Like, um, especially, well, it's both knees that I have arthritis in, but the one that's been bothering me most is my left knee. And it's like, I can't even straighten my leg. It's like, it's yeah, there's something like wrong. where, where the knee starts and the foot ends. It's like, it's twisting <clears throat> my leg to the point where my foot is like going outward and my leg is going outward. It's so if that was truly the case and you were really suffering that bad, you would do anything to get out of that pain, which would mean losing weight, 
eating healthy, taking vitamins, doing whatever you had to do to get your body in the best shape you could to fight that pain off. You don't do any of that, which makes me believe that nothing you say is true. We all know that your, your body hurts because you're morbidly obese. I've said it a thousand times, so is everyone else. No shocker there, but are you gonna do anything about it? No, you'll just lay there and complain, lay there and complain, repeat yourself over and over again. I'm in pain, I'm in pain. I have the pain. We heard you. Either do something about it or shut up. I don't want to hear about it if you're not willing to do anything about it. Don't complain about it if you're not going to fix it. You can fix it. It's not a chronic uh, terminal illness. Get over it. Weird. That is weird. It is weird. Yeah. I can't even straighten it. It's so much pain. Back fusion and hardware in my back with fibromyalgia and arthritis as well. So I I do understand that's one of the sure. back fusions probably coming up soon because of the arthritis in my back. But. Sausage. <laughs> this woman is unbelievable. Did you hear that? F fusion is is probably coming up next for me too. No one can have any illnesses. No one can be in pain except her. Back fusion is next. Next neck fusion. What else are you fusing? You're not getting anything fused. <laughs> Just like you're not getting knee replacements. Shut up. Pizza they sent. Beluga. Oh, yum. Yummy. I'll take some sausage pizza. Ashley has that too. I feel your pain, but we talked about that. I'm I'm living. It's living hell. It is. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, hey, you want to do this thing with me? Uh, It sounds fun, but I'm not going to have fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How about... Wow, well you certainly were having fun when you guys had all that money, weren't you? And you said you were diagnosed with fibro at 19 years old, so you were in the same amount of pain then when you were dancing around and going out and going to corn concerts and the Ruth Chris Steakhouse and going here to Lush and spending money here and going there and doing all the things you do, but now that you're broke, now if anyone asked you to do anything, you couldn't because of the pain. But before when you had money, you had no problems with pain at all. I find that extremely interesting, don't you guys? <laughs> I'm sure the women, can, my, my fellow pain patients can relate. How about when the pain is so bad, you end up going into a full, <laughs> a full out uh, heat flash? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Does that do? I've been so in so much pain that I've ended up in a hot flash, and those are getting really worse lately. <laughs> I get heat flashes. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. <laughs> oh, those are getting worse too, by the way. Especially the night sweats. Yeah. Like, what the hell is going on with me? Oh. I turned forty, and it's like I'm the incredible dripping woman. Oh. 40, you say? Let's just make you feel even worse, Shannon. Thanks, buddy. Oh, my God. Four chicken quesadillas and two Mountain Dew Baja Blasts. Oh. That kicks butt. I get mad as fuck in the summer. I'll lose my shit on whoever. <laughs> <laughs> no, the winter is the worst for me. When it gets cold out here, I'm I'm stiff, 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 stiff. She will never stop talking about herself ever. It's all, she's the most narcissistic jackass I've ever come across. Everybody gets stiff. I get stiff in the winter too. I have lupus. I don't sit here and complain about it day in and day out. Yeah, it sucks, but I carry on with my life like the rest of everyone else who experiences that exact same thing. Michelle Ann said, yeah, menopause, it's on the way. It, it, she, hers already hit, so. Yeah, I'm still in that peri phase of menopause. Uh, yeah. I don't recommend it for anyone, and and the women out there who've gone through it, I I feel your plight. Yeah. It's not fun. I see my mom go through it, and it's horrible. It's not fun. No. At my all? baby. Oh my god. I love you. I love you too. Wow. This dude right here is a good man, by the way. I try Despite to what other people want to try to say about him, he's a good man. I'm trying. I'm 24. He's a good man. He's a good man who kicked your son in the face and in the stomach and had your children taken away by CPS. But he's a good man right here? Okay. And my, I'm 24. I haven't had my period since I was 17. 
Wow. Cold weather, yeah. Shani, I've heard that you can experience menopause 10 years before it happens. It, <laughs> it's like 25 cold here now. That's actually... About 37 is when it all started. Yeah, that might have started when you got your tubes tied. That's what I'm thinking, C said. Yeah, it could have. That's what I'm thinking is accurate. I'm glad my tubes are tied. I would not want to bring a uh, child into this world right now. No. How bad it is right now and how bad it's probably going to be. Well, it's a good thing that the uh, good old state of Pennsylvania said you're not fit to be a mother, so you don't have anything to worry about. Yeah. Downloaded? Okay, cool. What's yeah. downloaded? I don't know. I don't know either. <laughs> Check in with us on Thursday. All right, Michelle Ann. Thursday, we're going to... we're. It'll be... Oh, that Thursday is... Is it Thanksgiving, sir? No. Yeah, I ain't doing well, Gucci Trolls. I got a massive... Thanksgiving is next week. Yeah, you can't copy and paste it. I'm sorry. You just got to put it in because it's the way they do things. They're fucking gay. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, that was my 90s person coming out. Yeah, you can't allow that on. I can't, I can't say that anymore. Not when we're on, no. <laughs> um, certainly not when you said that your child was part of the LGBTQ plus community. No, it's inappropriate. <laughs> <laughs> Language has, that's another thing that's happened in the last 20 years. Language has changed. Yeah, Thanksgiving, is this Thursday? Is, is it? it this Thursday? I thought it was next Thursday. Because it's always the last Thursday of November. Yeah, that it is the last Thursday of November. Which is conveniently the last day of November. Headache or neck pain, like tensing or stress. No, it's in my head, man. Yeah. Stop. Check messages on Turkey Day so I can make sure you're okay. Okay. We'll do, Michelle Ann. We'll try to. I hope you... I, I really don't... I have all of my notifications for Instagram shut off. So if I don't remember, I'm sorry. You know what would be good for... Hungry Man has like a Thanksgiving like meal thing. Who? Hungry Man. Oh. The frozen Thanksgiving meal shit. Okay. I mean, I don't know. Feels like the 90s. The 90s were nice. The 90s were awesome. Yeah, we did play that game. Well, Shani did. The Detroit Become Human or whatever. You played that a little bit. Mm-hmm. Can you get Amazon Fresh deliveries to your home by chance? I don't know. That is no, because yeah. uh, we don't have a Whole food yeah, in town. No, it don't work for us, Michelle Ann. Pizza Hut Pizza. Okay. Well, I'm waiting. I... Oh. You're going to be waiting <laughs> a, long, a long time. Worse than anything. The guy who plays Mr. Krabs is the in the game. I thought he was that was cool. Oh, oh, really? In Detroit Become Human. Okay. That is a great game though. Yeah. It's intense. From what I saw, it was really interesting. I'd like to try the others. Like, um, like it looks like it's that type of game where you like you can change events and stuff. And yeah. I'd like to it's change like a the time travel game. game. I have no idea. Walmart delivery? I don't know. I'm sure, we could get Walmart delivery. Yeah, I think. Yeah, somebody has sent us Walmart. Yeah, we can get that. Jesus, is that Nick now? No. Oh, that's two years ago. Nikado Avocado in Orland Home Fights Supercut. They're always fun. Like I said, message me anytime, Shani. Not trying to get cross boundaries. Just be kind. That's Michelle Ann. Thank you. Yeah, we appreciate that. Heavy rain. Yeah, many endings like heavy rain. I mm -hmm. heard heavy rain was really good. Yeah, I'll help you, Vixen. It won't let me put your cash app in. Uh, my cash app is... It's just... Uh, oh, I'm sorry, Rev. We're having a hard time hearing you. What was your cash app again? <laughs> I'm not playing it out here.
that's what it is. It's backwards, you know. <laughs> well, okay. What is it's your dollar is- sign? What is your issue that you can't put in our name? I, I I don't understand. Okay, just walk them through how you. You would hit the dollar sign, right? You hit the dollar sign in the app. Yeah. And you hit. Hey, like, just do ten dollars, like so, and then you hit you pay, and then whoever. You can hear Rev say twenty under his breath. Listen very closely. Her is on. Yeah. You put the cash tag on the top line. Yeah. And then it usually comes in. And yes, I'm under another name called Sherry Wood. <laughs> just so I don't have to constantly be hassled by certain people who just want to say some bad thing to me. And I'm just like, please leave me alone. I didn't do anything to you. And they're like, I don't care. I was told to no, hate you. No, no, no. Do not send any money to Rev Dude on PayPal. Don't do that. There's a PayPal that's pinned with the rest of them. It's at Shannon. Oh, I'm so sorry. You're breaking up again. We we can't. We don't know. We can't hear you. Needs love if you want a PayPal. Yeah. Don't send it to that PayPal. Wow, you have some attitude for somebody who's e-begging and asking for money, Rev. That's a dead PayPal. Yeah, it is because of a scammer, really. Yeah, we got scammed. No, that's that's all right. I'm just telling you don't don't give out Rev dude anymore. That's done. Rev's not Steve. No, I'm not. My name is not Steve. Miss <laughs> Steven. Steven. What are you doing, Steven? Steven. She got it. Oh, we, you know what? Hang on. All right. Thank you, Vixen. You know what? We should watch <laughs> that true crime with Steven in it. Yeah. Hey, Steven. And he's going back on the chair literally like, look at what I could do, Steven. We should watch the one with Hassan. That's now the doing. suitcase murderer. She is getting railroaded in court. Oh, I understand. Now you just saw it. The, the name was weird. Yeah. It's an alias because people try and find us and then shut down our financials. Who's just running around shutting off your financials? And why does it only happen to you guys and no one else? You you got scammed or you scammed somebody and got caught? Thank you, Michelle Ann. Yeah, people can be really cruel. I, and I, I don't understand that. They, they say they do it just to laugh, which is really sick, but. Uh, Google just shut down its AI. They shut it down? Yeah. Good. It's probably a good thing. AI is not going to like us. You know why? Because artificially. No, you guys know I'm not a fan of Rev, but I do. I do understand that he has a splitting headache. Could she please shut up for a second? Like, does she ever stop talking? It's ridiculous. Shut up, Shani. Intelligence is created in our image. It's going to be evil. Of course it's going to be evil. You know why? Because humans are evil. <coughs> Do we stand by our master? Maybe it'll actually be benevolent and good because we're not good and God is good. So maybe they'll flip it and they'll be actually good. I doubt it, though. I, I doubt it, too. I've been letting these jerks know how I feel and leave you two alone. Thank you, Michelle Ann. Thank but you. Don't, put, don't risk yourself. It's not worth it. But thank <laughs> But thank you. Because they'll try and find who, who you the are. Oh, Beauty is trying to reverse her dice <laughs> by herself. Yes, it worked. Did you hear the shh? That was you. That, thank you so much. Thank you, Vixen. God bless you so much. God bless thank you. Thank you so much. Praise Jesus Christ in heaven. But she's trying to reverse it herself, and she's eating the wrong food to reverse it. She really needs... So after 40 minutes of Jason sitting here e-begging, they finally get a donation and Shani does not even stop to say thank you. Okay, if anyone could get this by Chantal, please tell her to go on to the diabetic um, diet. I had... I oh my God, the obsession with Chantal. Let it go, Elsa. Chantal and you have nothing in common. No connection, not friends. Get off or you know what.
I had gestational diabetes with both of my sons. Most people don't like Chantal, honey. I know. So I really don't think but, we should talk about. Well, her. I'm just, I'm just saying, like, um, I went on the diabetic diet. Oh yeah. With both, you know, pregnant with both of my sons. Um, I had gestational diabetes with both. Um, the diabetes diet's going to be really easy for her because it's very similar to keto. Um very similar to keto diet and i know chantel does enjoy a keto diet oh do you know that do you know that she enjoys a keto diet if you're a diabetic then you have to stay away from sugar that's what you have to do you have to keep your sugar levels at an even place and there's you know there's two different types of diabetes you have no idea what on god's green earth you're talking about but you'll just keep rambling on about yourself like usual but i'll tell you i'll tell you what uh when nader used to cook her food all the time she did start losing weight because it's very low carb the food she you know has and and sh and also may i say when it comes to diabetes you don't want to have the bread okay you don't want to have bread a slice uh, a slice of whole wheat bread is worse on the glycemic index than a Snickers bar. Than a Snickers bar. A piece of whole wheat bread. It's worse on the glycemic in glycemic index. It's not. It, I know. I was shocked. I don't know how that works, but how about an entire liter of Dr. Pepper? How much uh, how much is that on the glycemic chart, Chen? Yes, you said it's the type of sugar. It's the type of sugar, yes. Because it's gluten and that's worse than just white sugar. It's called glue for a reason because it sticks to you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, she lost weight from doing cocaine. Yeah, that's correct. Oh well. I don't. I don't know why people do that stuff. No, I'm manic as it is. So. You're manic again? No, I mean in general, I'm manic. Oh. So why the hell would I ever take cocaine? That's like insane. Well, I'm borderline. So I wouldn't want to be on the edge even more than what I am. Well, I'm not that much. I'm a oh, Christ on a damn cracker, Shani. Is it ever not about you? I'm manic. Well, I have BID, so we know. We got it. Not everything is about you. Except that. You are such a damn narcissist. It's scary. Edge that much like I used to be. I'm not manic. I'm in, I've, I'm in massive pain. I've, I've, I've had. You poor baby. I bet if I get a cheap coffee, I'll feel better. Yeah, get some coffee. Get a two dollar coffee. Caffeine is really good. It's it helps me, that's for sure. If I had some BC powder, I would give you it. That always works. It really does. That's that stuff is really effective. I got taco sauce. Deal with the kids. You heard that right. She has taco sauce for Rev's headache. Taco sauce. Glad to help you too. Thank you, Vixen. Thank you. Thank you so much, Vixen. Um. Losing weight's hard to do. Takes a lot of self control. I wouldn't mind having a private group of women to have a video call and work out together. Oh, that would be that would be awesome. Yeah, that's a good idea. Hi, Gavin. Do you want to say hi again to the people? Here's the people, Gavin. Be so cute. <laughs> Little Gavin boy. He's really cute. Maybe if I put the light of my phone on you, you can see Gavin better. Oh my God! There we go. Thanks a lot. You know what the best is when you have a splitting headache and someone shines their flashlight in your eyes directly into your eyes that's <laughs> i can't i can't she is the she is insufferable insufferable if he ever did anything to her like that she would flip out <laughs> sorry man i feel really bad He's got this cool cool phone thing though, Jason, on his phone. He shakes his phone and the light comes on. I can't show you, obviously. No. Are you comfy, Gavin? Yeah. He's a good boy. Oh, 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 that feels good, doesn't it? You love our boy. You get the chin rubs. Uh. Uh, but it's it's just, <clears throat> I don't know what I'm saying, honestly. 
Hmm, maybe you've taken too many Gabbies today. Hmm, too much medication for you, and maybe you should just stop talking then. There is one thing that I'm looking for. I'm going to be looking in the grocery stores for, for Christmas, and that's some stolen. Yeah. I love stolen. That is good. Oh, it's so good. Last time you went to the store, do they have the um, Panatone yet? No. No Panatone yet? No. That's usually in big lots, I find. And here lies the reason why you blow through your EB team card money in nine days. Because this idiot over here is going to... Uh, did you get this? Do they have that? Get things you can make meals out of. What are you two doing? Don't let her shop or pick anything. Pick things that you can make meals out of. Pasta, um, be rice and beans, cheap things that you can get multiple days out of. Not whatever the hell you just said. I'm sure it's overpriced holiday crap that you don't need. This is, and here lies the exact problem. Here's why you're in the place that you're in. Because you're both as irresponsible as, as they come. So you're going to spend $13 on Panatone bread for Christmas time. Cool. And no egg, e eggnog yet? I haven't seen it. Dang it. That's weird. It should be there by now. If I went to a different grocery store, they probably have it. I'm sorry. Am I, is it just me? Or is Shani acting like they, they, they're just food shopping for the holidays as if they're not uh, drowning financially with no food or money? Did you get eggnog? Did you get the candy canes? Did you get the panettone? Did you get this? Did you get that? Get some real food. My poor baby. I feel really sick. I'm noticing. I don't understand this. I don't know what this is. It's probably caffeine withdrawal. I don't, I don't I've never felt caffeine withdrawal like this. Welcome to being addicted to caffeine. I, I think caffeine withdrawal is way worse than cigarette withdrawal. You know, with cigarette withdrawal, all I get is a little freaking irritated, you know? But with caffeine withdrawal, the headaches, stomach problems. Do you know what my heart rate was at though? What? 130. God, why is, you need to go to the doctor too. We need to set up a appointment for you. I'm really sick. Like I'm gonna throw up. All right. I don't know what's going on. I don't, that, that's really scary. Yeah, that is pretty scary. heart rate 130. Well, were you, did you run to get where you were? No. Or? And I was trying to calm myself down too really bad it's your anxiety the nurse went at the number she's like what is going on with you <sighs> okay stick with me on this so shani just said we need to get you to the doctor because rev said his heart rate was 130 as per the nurse the nurse said oh wow your heart rate's 130 what's going on with you so obviously he was seen by a healthcare professional you know what just dawned on me, my love bugs? Um, this job that he's getting paid for that he doesn't want to talk about, it's not employment. You know what I think it is? It's either giving plasma, giving semen, or, or giving... Um, yeah, I think that's it, right? Yeah, I think that's what he's doing. And I think you can go once a week or I don't know what the, what the rules are. That's what he's doing to get money. He doesn't have a job. And I think I just figured that out. <laughs> That's the only thing that makes sense. Because now the more that I think about this job thing that he's claiming he has. And how he goes there on Wednesdays. He's doing something like selling, you know, like donating sperm or donating his blood. He doesn't have any damn job. Way to give it away. Because the nurse probably takes your vitals before you give anything, which that's why his heart rate would have been so high. That's what he's doing. <laughs> Donating. <laughs> Jobless still. I'm sorry, honey. Yeah, I feel really, really sick right now. We gotta find a way how to lower your heart rate. Yeah. Is it, you think it's nerves? I don't know, honey. Or anxiety? I don't feel anxious or anything. No. I don't feel that. It could be a physiologic, physiolo, 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 I can't even say it. Physiological response to anxiety or stress. I, don't I mean, know. I. I don't know. You weren't working out or running or anything. No. No. <laughs> working out, mind you. Shit. 
Don't don't die on me like your dad did. Yeah. Forty seven he made it to. That's it. And his heart stopped. Can't I die first? But I don't eat like him. No, you don't. I don't eat super butter, 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 butter. He literally ate butter. So I don't think I'm just having something and I don't know it's today. 130 heart rate. What the hell is happening? Hypertension. I think I, my, my blood pressure was like 130 something over something. Hmm. It says the self-treatment is avoidance stimulant drugs, including caffeine and nicotine. There you go. That's what I said. I did have some cigarettes and stuff. She said, yeah, it's like two hours before you should not have cigarettes before you try and give. Yeah. I'm so you should wait two hours before you what? Before you give? Yeah, I heard that too. I'm sure it's blood because no one would take this man's semen ever. I'm just wondering why you're tachycardia. You have tachycardia like that. Um, yeah, we, we, you, you need to get your heart checked out. I feel like I'm gonna vomit. No, yeah. Let's see. She's checking my pulse, folks. And I'm sorry, I just can't look at the chat anymore, guys. I love you, but I can't. I can't. It is very it. fast. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with me. I don't. Um, I don't feel right, though. I can tell you that. <clears throat> I feel very lightheaded, and I feel like I'm going to throw up. Nausea. Should I go offline now? Um, yeah. Um, yeah, for now. Uh, yeah, we're gonna. I'm gonna. Ha you're gonna have to go to the doctor for this. Yeah, if I don't start feeling better, I might have to go to the hospital. I know. I'm not really not feeling right. All right, guys. I love you. God bless you. Thank you for everybody that's kind and thank you for giving. Jesus. Thank you so much, guys. Jesus bless all you guys. Well, that was painful. Now, wasn't it? I, I find it very hard to even get through that entire ridiculous video because I cannot stomach how this woman cannot even let another living being be in any kind of pain that's in any way, shape, or form anything like hers. She has the worst pain in the world. She has the worst this. She has the worst that. Everything's getting worse. Blah, 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 blah. She is the most self-centered, narcissistic jerk. And this is someone she supposedly cares about. This is her quote-unquote husband we're talking about who's got a splitting migraine and she's shining lights in his face, talking over him. Every single thing is a competition as far as bodily issues and, you know, pain issues and all that nonsense. It's so obnoxious. And I 1000% don't think that there was ever a job. Um, I knew that didn't make any sense. And I 1000% think that he is donating his uh, plasma or blood or whatever it is you donate. I don't know. I don't donate any of it. But um, that's what he's doing to make some extra dollars. And that's why it's my business. And I don't want to talk about it. Yeah, we all know why. But um, as far as uh, the people in, his, in their chat who were trying to help and, you know, say things like, you know, there's churches, there's this, there's that, it's Thanksgiving, um, you know, they give out free meals and, oh, they don't do that by us. Oh no, that happened, that already happened. We, that's, you know, that's, that's, guess what? Guess what, love bugs? Guess what I found? Funny, you're gonna laugh. Look at this. Look at all these places in Pennsylvania, all over Pennsylvania, actually, who do just that. They give out food at holiday time. They give out food to people with low income. 
Uh, they give gift cards. They do all kinds of assistance for people just like these two lovely individuals who are struggling and need food so bad. Um, but yet it doesn't happen near them. Look at all these places I found. And this is just some of them. There was more. Um, I just clipped you know, a bunch, but there's tons and tons and tons and tons of resources that these fools will never, ever, ever, ever utilize. So, um, they're full of shit. They, they're just liars who just really want cash. They don't want food. They don't want help. They don't want any of those things. They just want your money and your sympathy and, you know, they, whatever. I, I just, I, I can't stand when people can't help themselves. If you can't help yourself, then you have no business complaining because there is help out there. It, it's, it's just disgusting. And, um, I, I, I ugh, I'm so tired. Anyway, that's what I wanted to show you tonight, guys. Um, thank you guys for watching this. I know it was long. Um, I will be back soon. I love you guys very much. Hit the like on your way in or out. And um, I will look, I look forward to chatting with you all about this video. <laughs> so please leave a comment if you'd like. But um, I, I just found it very frustrating to watch her just constantly, constantly minimize what he was feeling or anyone else that mentioned pain just so she could talk about her damn self. Shani, we don't care. We don't care about your pain. Sorry, don't care. Do not care. But I hope you guys all have a wonderful Thanksgiving if I don't talk to you before then. I love you guys very much. And um, But I'll talk to you before then. I'll talk to you soon, guys. Have a good night. Bye-bye.